again. I had recorded a video earlier. That's why I'm wearing the same ornament. <laughs> All right, so I'm running out of daylight. I'm probably gonna have to edit in some brightness in here. So I apologize if the lighting's kind of weird and it's not the best quality, but I'm working with what I got. All right, so we're gonna do an unboxing video. I was able to find Delphlada on Lace Market for a very decent price. I got it for $100 for the JSK and the head bow. This will be the first dress I have where it's got the head bow with it. I actually ordered another dress from Claw the Child that should be coming today as well, so I'll probably be doing another unboxing video, but I'll be doing that separately whenever it comes. So I'm gonna open it. All right, let's open this thing. I'm always afraid when opening it, I have to be gentle, but. This actually came a lot faster than I expected. My mail office and just mailing in general to my house is always really slow. Doesn't matter what company I'm using or anything like that. So yeah, this actually came at the rate that it should have been. Okay. Oh, okay. Okay, so this is the JSK. Let me undo it. All right. This is a the Delph Lada JSK by Innocent World. It's a very cute brown color. Um, it's actually lighter brown than I thought it was going to be. I thought it was going to be like very dark brown, like almost this color. Maybe a little bit lighter than this color. It's very cute. I've been wanting this JSK for a long time. I actually really wanted it in the blue colorway. It's like a bluish green because it's like Delph. Like the patterning of um on like glassware um i really love it in blue but i found it in brown which i have a lot of brown and i like brown a lot for a classic and this was such a good price i was like i can't pass it up and it comes with the head bow which is very cute it's a very simple head bow um i've never had a head bow for a Dress, and I'm actually I'm surprised that it just comes off I mean I don't know why I figured that it was just gonna stay that's but when I make my own head bows that's what I do I leave them so that I can adjust them at any point um, but yeah it's very cute I like how it's a little bit floppy I think this is on I think I might have just put it back on upside down but you get the idea <laughs> Um, it's got very cute lace details. They're like little flowers. Um, there's little, let's see. I'll put, I'll go to the print more so. There is these really cute, um, the lots of deer. Very cute, very storybook. The little bunnies. This is Innocent World and I love it because it reminds me of those storybooks that I used to read as a kid, you know, the ones that have the gold binding. It kind of had a similar vibe, like the pattern on this. Um, I really wanted to keep into just going into more like cotton um, dresses. This isn't cotton, this is like a polyester, but I just really like this print a lot. So I'm not really a print person and the way Innocent World fits me is just very flattering for me. So. That's the hope. I'm gonna try this on and show you guys. But I actually have the Delph Lotta mini skirt too, but it's in the wine colorway. And I got that at a really good price, new, brand new with tags from Closet Child for like, I don't remember, but it was a really good price. I just remember being like, wow, okay. I didn't even know it was brand new with tags when I got it because I didn't specify that. But yeah, so Delph Lotta fan here. I'm gonna go try it on now though um, and show you guys what it looks like. Okay, so I have the dress on and like I said, I really love the fit of this. It's very flattering cut for me because of the way Innocent World usually does their JSKs is that it's a little bit lower waisted so it sits down here rather than like upper. And that's very flattering for me because I have a long waist. 
um, this head bow is very interesting. Um, I'm not really sure. I because this looks like it's upside down, so I don't know. <laughs> I have to adjust that somehow. I have to, you know, finagle it more, but um, it's very cute, you know? Like, it's a very subtle little head bow, and I love the way that it looks. It's, like, so cute on the side like that. Like, I wasn't sure about it. Like, I had gotten it, and I was like, that's a good deal for the head bow with it. And I was like, I'm not sure, though, like, how I'm gonna like the head bow once I get it, because it's, like, kind of floppy and stuff, and, like, you know, I, I, I don't know, it's just the polyester thing for me, but I actually really like the way it looks. I really like the way it looks with this wig that I'm wearing too, like the dark color. It makes it look very cute, especially with the cut and everything. So if I do wear this um, to like a meetup, I'll probably wear my wig with it because I just really think it looks really cute together. Um, as you can see, the bodice part having the little Lada and all his little friends it's really cute um i'm gonna try to show you guys a whole full body um so i'll be right back the bodice features the border print shown on the skirt of the dress um there's a bit of an odd shape on the sides of the bodice that i believe could be due to the zipper and how it was sewn into the structure of it um the print on the top almost gives like a faux empire effect, it's kind of interesting. Um, the straps are actually buttoned in the back, um, as you'll see in a second. I didn't realize one of the straps were out, so forgive me for that. Um, there's also a lace-up corset with really nice ribbon, and it's just really flattering and I really like it. Um, I hope you guys have a good day and thanks for watching.